A Boise family suffers a disturbing invasion in their home the night before Independence Day. Sewage leaking into their basement covering the floor, walls and their belongings in filth. It all came from a blocked city pipe, but the city says it's not its fault. Dick Miller has more on this on your side investigation. Kelly Gomez and her family live a quiet life in southeast Boise. But a peaceful night turned into a hectic scramble when Kelly's husband stumbled on this raw sewage gushing into the home. And we were dry heaving when we were standing on the stairs because it was so putrid. The plumber came out and quickly realized the problem was too big for him to handle. They knew that that amount of water could not come from my home. Crews went to the sewer lines in the street. All the manholes were full, so as fast as he could suck is as fast as the manhole kept filling up. Crews started pumping from the sewer pipe to get the blockage out. They discovered it was filled with this asphalt from the recent road construction. The city works department wasn't willing to come to the same conclusion. Did you guys ever figure out where the asphalt came from? Um, we, we're not really exactly sure. Uh, you know, you, you could go look at the property or the area yourself and, and maybe, uh, you know, make some assumptions. Even if the asphalt did come from construction, the city isn't legally at fault. Idaho Code exempts cities from liability in situations like this if they have properly maintained infrastructure. We are not legally liable because we have met all of our maintenance requirements on that pipe. Every 18 months we have to do maintenance and within the last 18 months we have maintained that pipe. A look into the maintenance record confirms the city met its legal requirements. So in the eyes of the law, the Gomez family is hung out to dry. <laughs> Thankfully, they are not without help. Boise has a no-fault policy that will give $10,000 to help in the repairs. That's why we put the no-fault in policy because it does come from our pipes and you know we, we, we still want to offer relief to the homeowners. Knowing the law of the land, the city says the safest option is to buy homeowners insurance that covers sewage backup. So if you live in a home that has a split level or a basement, you probably should check with your insurer to make sure they cover an overflow. Most standard homeowners insurance does not cover a sewer overflow. However, most insurers can offer a special rider covering that special event. Having that coverage could end up saving you tens of thousands of dollars here in Idaho. Live in studio, Jake Melder, Today 6 on your side.